Arriving at 2011, um, it, it was such a different feel from 2007 and, and for some of us 2003 as well. Actually understood uh, the importance of winning a World Cup and being at home, uh, that even heightened uh, the pressure that we were under. But I was lucky enough to have some really good men that I was playing alongside and, and some great coaches as well. And to be a part of that team, um, with everything riding on it, uh, we were in such a, a good space, even though the final didn't look like it. We looked a bit tight in the final, but you can just imagine what the pressure was like to win. And the All Blacks are the world champions for the second time. I remember um, sprinting onto the field, uh, once that whistle blew, grabbing all my teammates, you know, uh, uh, finding uh, where my uh, wife and kids were sitting up in the stand. It was so funny because there was just so much energy in, uh, in, the, in the stadium. And then going back into the uh, changing room and just seeing everyone just laid out, there was no energy left, you know? So we left everything out there and uh, it was actually really quiet and, and somber for, uh, for, for 10 or 15 minutes in the, in the changing room. More relief than it was uh, excitement once we had a chance to sit down and take the boots off. We had a great time together. We paraded all around New Zealand and uh, I remember seeing Queen Street here in Auckland. You couldn't see the pavement. That's how much people were around and that's just amazing, you know, something that um, we've always gone in, 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 in as the favourites, that we were lucky enough to make sure we could get the job done at home. One of the challenges that lay ahead for us as All Blacks was, you know, no team has gone back to back and winning Rugby World Cups. Being part of the All Blacks uh, and their proud legacy it was something that excited me. The challenge of, was I good enough to, to go another four years and um, well, would we be good enough as a team to be able to go back to back? So it will be the All Blacks to kick off their defence of the Rugby World Cup round that they won four years ago. For a few of us, we were going into that tournament knowing that that would be our last time playing as All Blacks and for some of us, uh, last time playing at all. So there was a definite motivation for us to make sure we leave our best rugby out on the field and in that tournament. No New Zealand match complete without this. The Hacker. It's a huge honour to be able to lead the, the haka for the All Blacks. I actually practiced heaps when I was about six year old in the backyard. And so um, I had heaps of practice, but uh, I can tell you it's quite nerve wracking having to make sure that we, uh, we're aligned and we're tight and we're ready to go before a match. So I've had a few times where um, singing the anthem, uh, I've had blank spots and so I've had to um, pull up alongside Pity or uh, one of my teammates and get a quick could you just give me the first couple of words and then boom, back into it. But uh, that is a huge honour and it's a great tradition, not only of rugby, but of all black rugby as well. New Zealand against Australia in the World Cup final. When I think back to the game, it just had its moments. We played really well in the first half. We got off to a really good start and uh, I still remember hearing from Shandy, our manager, he said, Kiwi, you know, time to warm up. I said, yeah. Ready to go. And at that time, we had Ben Smith go off with a yellow card. And so we might have been up by a couple of tries. And by the time I went on, uh, the gap had closed to like three points while Ben was off. And so my mindset had changed quite a bit from, from when I got told to warm up. For us as a team, we love those challenges. And if anything, it just uh, makes you just focus on the, on the world that you have to do. So it was an enjoyable um, game to be a part of. It was an awesome way, especially how uh, how Bodie was able to score that last try, just a nice way to just go, what a final. It actually felt really good, you know, Oof, yes, amazing. <laughs>